Hey, this is Dan from userspice.com, and I am so excited to welcome you to learn PHP the easy way. Um, the first question you might ask yourself is, why in the world would I want to learn PHP? Um, there's so many languages out there, and if you Google and you start pounding around forums and stuff like that, people will tell you anything from Python to all the new JavaScript and their libraries and all that kind of stuff. And a lot of times you'll hear people kind of trash PHP and they'll say, oh, PHP is dying. You know, but if you Google what percentage of websites use PHP, it's 80%. And as far as the dying things, if you look at the statistics, you can see uh, that line's pretty dang straight. Um, you know, PHP is not going away anytime soon. And in fact, a lot of the things that people have to say negative about PHP um, are just, they're going away. It's fast. It's memory efficient. It's secure. Um, at least as secure as you want to write it. And so... I really think that C that PHP is one of the best languages that you can learn to get started in web development. And from PHP, you can get into databases and you can get into JavaScript and you can get into all these other things. But learning PHP is such a great start. And so what we're going to do now is we're going to do the course that I wish that I had when I was learning. I was self-taught and I poked around on courses on Facebook and YouTube and Udemy and all these other things and, and I I learned a lot and that's how I learned. But I wish I had a class like this. See, for me, let me tell you a little bit about myself. For me, I have been to a lot of places. And so I've been to 70 countries, I've been to all 50 states. And one of the things you run into with that is language. And I took French in high school and Greek in college and, and had to learn some Spanish for my job. And I just hate learning languages. And one of the reasons why I hate it is because you spend so much time up front trying to say, donde esta el baño? And then if the person gives you a detailed description, you don't understand it. And so... The thing that's so frustrating to me about learning a language is that you can't just have conversations right off the bat. And that's the same thing with learning a, a coding language. You start with variables and arrays and all these other things, and you could be months and months before you actually build a, a usable application that you could show to your friends and say, this is what I'm building. And I'm here to fix that. That's what this course is for. This course is to help you get from the very beginning of knowing basically nothing about PHP to being able to write absolute, complete working applications. And how are we going to do that? We're going to do that with User Spice. And I'm not going to give you the full tour right now, but what I love about this is that this is a tool that I wrote when I was learning how to write PHP, and I've been updating it for the last four years. And basically, with a click of a button, we can jump right through all the boring stuff. We can jump right through the logins and creating users and all of that kind of stuff and get right down into the nitty-gritty of developing our application. And so we're going to use this framework that you can come back to and you can build anything off of it. I use it to build escape rooms. I use it, I use it to build giant interactive walls. I use it for applications that are just on the local network of a company and public facing websites. It does massive calculations. Companies use it. Governments use it. It's used in every single nation on the face of the earth for something. And we're going to use this powerful tool to just jump right in and build the important parts of our application. So I hope you're getting excited. I hope you're interested. And I hope that you're ready to see what we're going to build next.